set up USB overdrive, uh, first install the program, then go up to the Apple icon in the Mac menu bar and click it. Go to System Preferences. In System Preferences, you'll find the USB overdrive icon. Here it is right here. Go ahead and click on that and you get the USB overdrive settings window and probably see any mouse, any application here selected uh, when you first do this. So you want to go over here with your Tetra mouse plugged in, uh, click on the button on the right of this little bar and you get all these selections. Now you will see I have a whole bunch of Tetra mouse listings here. Uh, that happens when you plug in anything into a different USB port it uh, it gives you the port number that you plugged it into so I currently have the Tetra Mouse XS plug, plugged into the uh, into this one here at uh, that shows the port address there uh, if you're doing this the first time you should only see the Tetra Mouse listed one time so I'm going to select the one that I know is plugged in and you can see I already have it enabled if it's not enabled you click right here to enable it then you can click on any of these buttons to see how they're set up I have the left button just to act as the quick mouse button that's a standard left click quick type you can set the quick type you can well you can set it to anything you want mouse buttons let's see press key you have all, all sorts of things but you're gonna probably want to leave the left button assigned as the left button uh, the quick type is a quick you can you have all these other options you can change it to uh, and just like the the right button does a right click we select the middle button and I have that to move to scroll and direction vertical now the uh, what this does this makes it like what happens on a Windows machine when you click the middle button in a scrollable window it allows you to scroll by moving the mouse pointer in the direction that you want to scroll um, anyway I have button 4 set up as a keyboard shortcut to type back and 5 is forward and that is that performs the uh, back and forward functions in most web browsers just about all of them button six I have set up to do a command plus minus uh, I believe that's a zoom out in uh, in a browser window and button seven command plus equals which is a zoom in, I think. Now I'm not sure about that without testing it again. It's been a while since I looked at this. Uh, button eight, I have it set to launch the application dashboard. And uh, then I have, you have wheel up, which is set up to do a scroll in the up direction and wheel down scrolling down direction so that's basically all there is to it you can click on the status button to see what devices are connected that you can uh, control with USB overdrive and you'll see that the Tetra mouse is listed here if you click on the little arrow it shows you some details and that's pretty much all the basics